Hey everybody, what's up? My name is John Luke, and I am a big uh, fan of fighting games, but I'm also really, really bad at them. For the last couple of years, every time a new fighting game has come out, I say to myself, this is it. This is the one. This is when I take fighting games seriously. And then it doesn't happen. Now I'm trying to do it again, this time with Street Fighter V, uh, but to give me some extra incentive, I'm going to be playing 10 matches uh, every weekday, so that's Monday through Friday, uh, as sort of my goal. And then on the weekend, I'm going to make a wrap-up video like this one, where I will sort of uh, give a little um, sum up of my progress and kind of see how I do each week. By the way, all these matches will be streamed on Twitch if you are interested in watching. Okay, let's start by establishing me. Uh, my fighting game skill level is somewhere past button mashing in the knows just enough that they're a danger to themselves category. Uh, I know a lot of the moves and basic concepts, but not really like how and when to execute them. The character I am maining is Cammy. I do know all of her moves, uh, but I'm not able to do all of them flawlessly quite yet. Uh, stuff like her cannon spike still gives me a little bit of trouble. Okay, so I wrote down my little cheat sheet. Let's see here. Uh, starting off on Monday, I had three wins out of ten. Uh, that's going to be my baseline. That is where I am at. Three out of ten. Uh, these are ranked matches, by the way. Uh, Tuesday was about the, uh, the same. Um, not really much progress there. Uh, I felt like most of the matches, even the ones I lost, were pretty close. Um, none of them felt like complete wipeouts, which uh, I guess that's good because even when I lose, I feel like I'm still getting some progress there. Uh, Wednesday, ooh boy, Wednesday was terrible. I uh, only won two matches, and I didn't win those actually until the very end. Uh, the first eight matches were abysmal. I don't really know what happened that day. I think I was just having an off day because it was, uh, ooh, it was really bad. Thursday. Thursday is the day that actually got really interesting. So uh, I won four matches out of my ten, which is awesome. I'm improving a little bit. There were two really uh, standout matches from those that were definitely the highlights of the week. Uh, one of them I actually got a perfect on uh, first round, which was awesome. And then uh, the guy rage quitted on me, so I didn't actually get to finish the match. Uh, and uh, because I recorded these, I can point it out. It's this guy, right here. He's the one who did it. Uh, and because of that, I did not end up uh, counting that in my 10 uh, because it was not a full match. So even though I did get the perfect and feel pretty awesome about that, uh, I don't think it, it can really count as like a progress check for me. The other match was this really awesome match where I lost the first round, I was doing pretty bad, and I was actually doing really bad in the second round. And then I had this real crazy uh, come from behind victory where I just kind of came out of nowhere and, and completely uh, wiped him near the end. And it felt awesome and invigorating and it was so great. And I was ready for the third match. It was going to be the tiebreaker. And then I experienced the worst lag I have ever seen while playing this game. It was completely unplayable. I mean, if, you, if you're watching this right now, just, oh my god, it was awful. Uh, so it seems that, I guess, for whatever reason, it wasn't as bad for him because he was still able to, like, kind of do stuff a little bit. And, uh, yeah, he ended up um, beating me in that. So I also didn't count that one because it, uh, while it technically does count as a lose for me in the game, uh, I feel like that's, that doesn't really actually feel indicative of my progress uh, because I, I didn't lose because I was bad. I lost because of... The, uh, you know, the lag from the game. So I didn't end up counting those two matches, um, but I still ended up with four out of uh, 10 for the ones I did count, which again, pretty great. Uh, and finally for Friday, I ended up back with just three wins. Uh, so kind of going back to where I was before, meaning uh, Thursday, definitely the standout day. The only real note I had of Friday was that uh, a couple of the matches I did there no longer felt like um, real close ones. There were a couple, one with a, a Ken player in particular, where he just really wiped the floor with me in a way where it felt like I was starting to fight players of a much higher skill level than me. So I, it felt like a wake-up call of like, okay, now this first week, kind of just getting the feel for everything, I'm starting to fight people who are just so much better and I need to really um, step it up if I want to uh, keep improving. Yeah, so for first week, I think it wasn't bad. Um, I, I feel like I've, um, I'm getting much more of like a grasp on uh, basic fundamentals and just kind of the flow of the game and, and I think next week my goal is to start stepping up. I'm going to look at, uh, watch some videos of Cami players. Uh, a lot of the stuff I was doing with Cami felt very basic. My combos were uh, incredibly simplistic so I think I need to start uh, learning some more advanced uh, combos and techniques. 
So it's not enough for me to just uh, be playing the game, obviously. I need to uh, look up videos and uh, cool tips and tutorials. There's lots of great ones online for you to really improve your skills. So I wanted to spend uh, the end of each of these videos highlighting uh, like a video or tutorial that I've seen that I thought really helped me out. Uh, and so if you yourself want to check some out, uh, you can go uh, see them. Uh, this week I'm going to highlight uh, J.M. Crofts, who is a guy I found over on the, uh, the Giant Bomb forums actually. And uh, he's been making a bunch of really short uh, tutorial videos for Street Fighter V. Uh, they're all about like one or two minutes. They're great for beginners, uh, really easy. He's great at explaining uh, concepts and just simple little uh, tips and tricks that can really help out a player. And I highly recommend his videos. Go check them out. All right, guys, that is it for week one. I'm feeling pretty good about this so far. We'll see how week two goes. I will be uh, streaming again starting on Monday. Uh, hopefully with the uh, brand new Street Fighter V update. Should be out like uh, Capcom claims it will be. And uh, yeah, see you next time.